Hello, my lovelies. So, um, I got this to do. Yeah. So me and my lovely partner have decided to do a build swap. And this is what he's done for me. I've done a build for him and he's done one for me, as you can see. I will show you my build right now. Hello! Okay, so this is my little build I did for Spud. Now, I'm, I'm flying over here. You can see it on the minigrap. But I'm flying over here because um, I might have made a bit of noise. So I'm just doing this while I can actually talk normally without, you know, shouting. So, <laughs> you ready for the reveal? Okay, there it is. This is magnificent. This make actually no, it's not. It really hurts my eyes. And there's the noise. I made a noise machine, just because um everyone loves um random doors. So I'm gonna go through and explain everything just as quickly as I can. So this is where you started. Well, where first started. In. Actually, I need to put on the texture pack. Okay, so I got the texture pack on. So this is like the starting thing. So he should have read this. And if you haven't noticed that two of them are different colours, that's just to kill his OCD and, you know, really annoy him. Because he doesn't like random blocks right beside each other. And I also did this because of that same reason. So he, he was able to see the picture, so we can move on. There are two there are two noise machines under here. So there's one in, in the middle of the garden, one in the middle of the house. So they <laughs> are definitely loud. And I'm not gonna lie, they're probably the first thing other than this I built. So I was literally building with a uh, noise machine going along. <laughs> probably wasn't the best idea. But hey, so as you can see, really multicolored house. I'm kind of copying green with this. I'm aware of that, but I am also aware that Spud does not like random blocks that do not look good right beside each other. So I, I did that. And also same with the garden. A uh, little yard garden thing and the house so oh, the little shed so yeah everything here is just to make it look like it's out of place so that is that's is the main reason with that why am I lying so I'm gonna have to turn down volumes hang on let's just turn down the master volume it's still pretty loud. So this is pick a door. They're both the same. They are literally the same. So you can go into e either one. They are exactly the same. And guess what? They're infinity rooms. I'm sorry if this is obnoxiously bright. Too bright. My ones have got sunglasses. It's, it's exactly the same thing. So I'm going to go into the other one. So yeah, this is infinity room. As you might notice, there are squares. But that's because the exit showed one of these squares so it's kind of like okay if I leave this as it is it's gonna be too obvious on the way on the how to get out so I just added those are the other ones but this one is actually the way out and then in here we've got the dragon room just because I kept annoying spuds whilst building kill with dragon heads so you know I did that one and then oh, I left you out did I so yeah he spawns. So if you just walk along here, we get Boo. Boo spawns. And then this room is just empty because I really wanted to just jump scare him. So. And he doesn't spawn again. But this is the other exit for the other room for this room. And then upstairs, this is obnoxiously bright. Like, I did all the staircase and all this as just random blocks in here. I made him feel my pain. Just, just sea lanterns everywhere. And in here, you might find, okay, there's nothing in here, but if I go into survival a second, I'm already low on food. I'm gonna need this. So these <laughs> gave him some golden potatoes and golden apples. <laughs> so yeah, let's just do this. But if you go through the door, um, that happens. <laughs> this is just to really annoy him with getting in the door. You can do it, obviously. See, it is possible. But there are actually 
pufferfish down here. So they both named haha. -ha. <laughs> you know, just to just to really annoy him. So and then out here there isn't actually anything. This is just a balcony. There wasn't any. I I couldn't really think of what else to put out here, so I just left it. But the coup de gras is obviously upstairs. So this is just a balcony. And uh, yeah, so coming here last. This is the coup de gras. This is what I needed the texture pack for. So welcome to M's art collection. Before I do that, I'm actually going to go back to the start because I didn't actually say the whole objectives of this map. Sorry. <laughs> noise machine. So welcome to the house of torture where I have created everything that will annoy you or hurt your OCD. I put that one deliberately on a different color sign. Emma's here somewhere on this map. Can you find her? Oh and there's something wrong with the house. If you can't find out what you'll find out at the end. You're in all the rooms. So hopefully he's actually done that. Just flew through the wall. Uh, roof. So I am on this map somewhere. Hopefully he hasn't figured it out yet. And there is also something wrong with the house as well. And hopefully by the time he got to this he hasn't figured it out either. So welcome to M's art collection. So if you don't know me, I'm quite a large anime fan. And there's one anime in particular I love. And that is Ikatsuki no Yona. So I did this. Because uh, Hack is my one, number one husbando. So I did this just to really annoy him. And then... Uh, I put these two signs here. So <laughs> this is the, the clues for where I am and what's wrong with the house. So by the way, if you didn't work out what's wrong with the house, it's long it's longer on one side than the other. Haha, <laughs> no symmetry. So the truth about this house is it is one block f hang on, I'm gonna It's one block longer that side. So <laughs> That is the problem with the symmetry. So it's 11 blocks to 10 blocks, I think, on one side. So I think this one here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So this one's 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So it's 9 to 10, actually. I got it wrong. So yeah, that is slightly lopsided. So I found that quite funny. Like I made sure that it was not symmetrical but close enough that he wouldn't notice this. That's why I was getting out with that. So <laughs> and then just at the end he would just be like, no, this whole build is not symmetrical because he really likes symmetrical buildings for some reason. And then um, if you haven't found him, press F5 on your keyboard twice. So I, I literally put my head and <laughs> leather clothes that look like mine so yeah he was actually um this whole time yeah that's oh, that's the house that i built for his bud so onto his wonderful creation so loud just get away from that <laughs> it's beautiful it's just beautiful so yeah that was my build if you haven't noticed it's everything that would annoy him and he's done the same with me. So I'm not, I don't know whether I'm looking forward to this. <laughs> so if you enter, you accept all liability. Use the obsidian to block off plate, block off places. <laughs> Please use the items in the chest. If you, except if you play in hardcore mode, which I'm not gonna do because I suck at PVE and I'm guessing from what he said, there's a lot of PVE. <laughs> Uh, he's giving me all this stuff and why? <laughs> okay. Spud, what are you, what, what have you been up to? He told me to, to change into survival as well. So he's giving me all this stuff, so I'm gonna guess that he is down to, uh, PvE. And he's talked a lot about wardens, which doesn't really give me much hope. Uh, let's just do this. Okay. So, yeah, we're not... It's, why doors? <laughs> well, regular, well, rectangular enjoy square TNT house. Okay. 
I mean, I don't want to click on that because it will set off the TNT. So, um, <laughs> can I just break through? Why is that obsidian there? It's for I just break through. I mean, it's easy enough because TNT is really br easy to break. And I have a feeling that's going to set up, set off the TNT. So I'm just, I'm just going to do that. And there's more in here. Um, <laughs> stand on the trap door and click the button. Oh yeah, then the lava will kill you. Um, okay, what's, what is the pressure plates for? <laughs> I don't, I don't want to stand on them because they'll just set the, oh, slime, okay. Ah. Okay, that hurt. And, oops. And this is. <laughs> it's just loads of dispensers. Why? There's nothing in them. Or have you done what? Ah, uh, yeah. You remembered. Okay. So, if you don't know, back to my least favourite mob on Minecraft. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I kind of saw this coming. This is just lovely. Okay, so let's press that. It's a very nice door. Um, how does Okay. Can I? Block this off if you just want an advice. <laughs> okay, so this is the warden bit. Please go silently. I may have gone overboard. Everything is voice act voice activated. Let's just blow that off. Could you die? You're the worst mob in Minecraft. Okay, use the sink. Ah, uh, okay. We've got some snowballs. So this is the warden bit. Is that moss carpet or is that carpet? That's moss carpet. That's not going to do any good. <laughs> we got sneak. So, there's a dispenser over there, which, and oh, why are there so many dispensers? Why do I feel like there's a tripwire hook here somewhere? Of course there's a zombie around here somewhere, so let's just go. Why do I feel like there's a tripwire hook here just to set off those dispensers? <sighs> Got some nice uh, shriekers there. That's nice. Hello, this is editing Emity. I just realized I didn't even have to sneak because uh, he put carpet down. I didn't even need to sneak. So, yeah, okay, on with the video. Spud, you do know I actually like going through deep uh, deep dark things, don't you? Right, we should be safe now. Run as fast as you can, trust me on this one. Did you just... Oh, you got lava buckets, that's... 
I see TNT. Why is there TNT? Okay, we just gotta run. Let's go. That's nice. <laughs> But I don't know if you made it to be like that, but okay. Um, I don't know if that worked as you wanted it to. <laughs> um, follow the light only. Leave her inside. I could not. <laughs> Okay. Follow the light only. See, there's a tripwire hook there. So we gotta follow the light, yeah? So. Yeah, that happened. Uh, okay, we got another sand dot. What is with this? <laughs> I might have to give myself some blocks just to get over these. Hmm. Next, um, I'm gonna have to do this. So it's. <laughs> Why are these here? Uh, do I check? Silverfish! Yo! Paris! But... You know that this is... This is... This is heaven for me. I might have to eat on a apple. Oh my god, there's so many. <laughs> Or are you trying to make me kill Silverfish? Because that would be hell. Can I read the signs, please, Squeakers? Sacrifice Hexen. No. Oh my god, there's so many and they love me. Um, next room for psychology. Choose one to open the door. I mean, they both open the trapdoor. Sacrifice Vanitas or Sacrifice Hack? I mean, we both know this option, don't we? <laughs> but I mean, there's nothing in there. Oh, it's a cat. It's a cat named... Oh. How many silverfish eggs did you put in there, person? Well, we know what I'm going to do. See, I knew you were going to do that. That you would do reverse psychology. But, you know, press the wrong button and that will work. Yeah, that doesn't do it either. So, what do I do? Okay, yeah. So, there we go. Streams everywhere, eat some. No. It's been infested. Yeah, of course, that's been infested. Why do I have to eat some mushrooms? <laughs> what is this? I, I don't understand this one. Why are you telling me to eat at some mushrooms? Were you telling me to break mushrooms? What? I'm confused. I don't know what this one is. I'm sorry. Um. Oh, mushrooms. You what? <laughs> Take your inventory. Just break it. 
I mean, I checked my inventory a while ago. You can't trick me with that. <laughs> Especially with the, um, the horde of lava buckets. So... Yeah, you can't trick me with that. We've got some uh, mushroom stew. I don't know if this is he's given these effects. I don't know if he knows how to do that. Okay, so another post recording thing. I asked him what the mushroom thing was and he said it's because I don't like mushrooms at IRL. That's that's why he did the mushroom room. That uh, on to the next bit. So it it says just break through. Why do we have resistance and fire resist? Uh, whistle, whistle. <laughs> Don't you want to bonk them? I mean, not really. Have a sleep. No, uh, I'm fine. I mean, it's even daytime. Uh, nighttime, sorry. Netherite swords. I've already got one. <laughs> Just look at them anymore. Why are there um, mobs in the walls other than these guys? That's interesting. I mean, he's telling us to go to sleep. So I guess we gotta go. To yeah, it's it's not night time. <laughs> Unless you're making me reset my spawn point. No sweat. Hey, by the way, did you murder them? I'm disappointed if not. Good job. Whistles away. What? This is honey. Why did you... You do know that that's not actually that hard to see. <laughs> Um, cold because you hate being cold. What? I don't hate being cold. I hate being hot, not cold. <laughs> Enjoy the pathway of light. I mean, with shaders on, that is actually quite blinding. But. I might have to turn the shaders off because this is actually painful. And I mean, Spud, you know that I don't like lots of light um, sea landers right beside each other. <laughs> uh, okay, what do we. Oh, that is. That is indeed a treehouse. <laughs> tree one, tree two. Is this another reverse psychology? To just really annoy me. This. <laughs> that thing is better than Yone of the Dawn. If you don't press it, well, I make I can make fun saying you like Luffy more. <laughs> if you can disagree, click the button and show Sun Hack is better than Luffy. <sighs> this reverse psychology, man. <laughs> Well, you know how much I hate One Piece. <laughs> uh, what do I do? Do I press it? Oh, I did not know how to get you out, so bye. Are you just gonna blow me up? <laughs> Have I gotta somehow jump over? I see TNT, but I don't know. Oh, there's a pressure plate there. Can I? <laughs> I don't know if you. <laughs> okay. That is a lot of TNT. Why? <laughs> I like how oh, it didn't work. <laughs> well, I'm guessing that's it. Okay. 
that was, that was good, but never never say that Luffy is better than Hack, because that's not correct. <laughs> so yeah, that was very good. Thank you, Spide, for doing that. If you want to see his version or his reaction for seeing what I've done for him, please go and see his his channel. It will be linked down below. Oh, I can see you've had a few attempts here. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Use a lot of the amount of support you give me, and I shall see you guys in the next one. Bye bye! What's your story? What's your sign? It's like we're twin flames in a different life. Deep connection